is up guys Dylan back here um today is a day that I've been looking forward to for months and I've been looking forward to today for two reasons reason number one today is opening day for Major League Baseball and so, and so this afternoon, I think around 2 o'clock to be exact, we got the Braves versus the Phillies. Max Freed will, will pitch for the Braves today, and Christian Pache will start in center field for the Braves. So, and so I'm, I'm excited about the Braves this year. Obviously, last year didn't end the way... That us Braves fans wanted. Uh, uh, blowing a three three to one game lead in the NLCS. Oh God. Oh, the Braves are one win away from the World Series. But you know, you know, hey, you know what though? That's in the past. That's in the past. It's a today starts a whole new season. Today starts a whole new season. And today the Braves start start the season against the Philadelphia Phillies, which, by the way, I can't stand. I can't stand Philadelphia fans, and I'm talking about just in general, whether it be Eagles, Phillies, whatever. I I cannot stand Philadelphia fans. I cannot stand them. So. And so, and I, and I also think it's funny that for the last two years, the Phillies have gone on a spending spree in free agency, and that has resulted them in zero playoff appearances. Zero. <laughs> and so, I'm excited about the Braves this year. We'll see what they do. I mean, they resigned Ozuna, um, Pache, Pache, Pache's on the Major League roster, um, they decided to leave Pablo Sandoval on the opening day roster because he had a very good spring, so hopefully the Braves can win the, so hopefully at the end of the regular season the Braves can win the division, get into the playoffs, and finally, finally make it to the World Series and win it. Because I am ready. I am ready for a championship. So. That was re so that's reason number one why I'm excited about today. Now. Reason number two. And this, probably the, and this is probably the biggest reason why I'm excited today. Tom tonight. At 7 p.m. Central Standard Time. I am finally going to see. Godzilla versus Kong. And I can I have been waiting for this movie since it was announced back in 2015. I I have been ready. I have been looking forward to this movie since it was announced in 2015. We were supposed to get it last year, but obviously COVID COVID delayed it. But you know what though? Now, you know what? All that doesn't matter now. It's here, and I'm and I'm going to see it tonight. And right now, and, and right now, it's gotten good reviews from critics. It's doing very well in the box office. And hopefully, that convinces Toho to let Legendary make more movies in this monster verse. I mean, I mean, I mean, I've been watching Godzilla movies since I was a little kid. I've, I, I, I grew up with them. In fact, the very first Godzilla movie I saw as a little boy was Godzilla vs. King Kong. And even though that movie is cheesy, and it's cheesy, and corny, I also, I also call it good Cheesy. It is also good, cheesy fun. And so, and so, to me, 
And so, to me, this is, this is like bringing back a part of my childhood. I mean, I mean, I mean, and from what, and from what I've been reading of the reviews and everything, and all the groups I'm in, especially one group I'm in on Facebook. See, I'm in a group on Facebook that's, that, that's just nothing but Godzilla, but big Godzilla, Godzilla fans like myself. From what they've been saying in this Facebook group, I have a feeling when I when I sit in the theater tonight, I am gonna feel like a little kid again. I I think when I'm sitting in the theater watching this movie tonight, I'm gonna feel like a little kid again. And you know what? There ain't there ain't nothing wrong with that either. Look, we all have some little kid kid we all we all still have little kids in us, and, and there ain't nothing wrong with that. And so, I am going to see this movie more than once. I am going to see it more than once. Like I said, I'm going I'm to see it for the first time tonight, and then I'm going to see it again either tomorrow night or Sunday afternoon. I, I can't see it Saturday because I'm already seeing another movie, because I'm already seeing another movie's Cause I'm, all, I'm already going to sit on. Oh. <laughs> can't talk right now. All right. I can't see it. I can't see it again Saturday because Saturday afternoon I'm going to the movies with my church to see a Christian movie. So I already have plans for Saturday. So and so I will see Godzilla vs Kong for a second time either tomorrow night. Or Sunday afternoon, whichever one I decide. To me, it will probably have to depend on what I'm doing tomorrow. If I'm not doing, if I, if nothing comes up tomorrow, tomorrow, and I'm not doing anything, then I'll probably go see it again tomorrow night. So, but but if something comes up tomorrow, then I'll see it. Then I'll see it again Sunday afternoon. Now. I am going to eat, I am I am going out to eat before before I go see the movie. There is I'm going to, there is a there is a coffee shop that has really good food that I'm going to eat at that's right across the street from the movie theater I'm going to. And so and so probably and so and so later today, while I'm in that coffee shop, I'm probably gonna, I'm probably going to do another video. Probably a vlog, which is short for a video log. I'm probably gonna do a vlog of me probably eating at the coffee shop, and then, and then, and then I'll, and then when I'm done, I'll walk across the street to the movie theater and head inside, and then, and then, um, and then I'll probably stop the video um, after I after I get inside the movie theater, and so, so, and so, be on the lookout for that. So, anyway, guys, that's it. I just wanted I just wanted to make make this make this video. Like I said, I will probably make it. I'll probably do another video later tonight. Um, as I'm heading towards the movie theater. So, so anyway, guys, I hope you have a great day, and God bless.